Today we're with the FIB's ATU Department Anti-Terrorist Unit or Anti-Terrorism Unit and we're on a call about a, a terrorist group here setting up a bomb in the subway station. So right now we're in Burton in the Rockford Hills area. Um, we've got reports that this organization has taken over this underground terminal and is setting up some type of bomb. That's what our intel suggests. We've got a lot of vehicles out here, a lot of personnel. We we'll just walk around and check it out before we head down. We even have reporters out here because this whole area is completely shut down at the moment. Here we got units looking at the layout of the subway and determining um, where exactly the enemy is based on our intel. We've got kind of a command tent set up here with uh, monitors of any type of, of camera system down there that we have access to. More briefing going on. Cut. A raving crowd out here that is uh it's curious as to what what's causing this ambulances are on scene as well in case uh, you know if we have injuries they'll be ready to assist we've got weasel news over on the south side of this blockade and they are reporting the story so yeah, it's, it's a pretty big spectacle here. All right, let's go ahead and brief with one of these units standing over here. See if we have any new intel and then we're gonna head down there and see if we can take this enemy out. All right, do we have any new intel on what they're doing down there? Do we have uh, an idea of of how many people are down there. Okay. Sounds like uh, they believe between 10 and 15 armed individuals are down there. We have been authorized to shoot. No casualties have happened so far, but we know they're well equipped and well armed. We're going in. Yep. All right, see a couple enemies down there. Oh my gosh. Chaos! Alright guys, be careful. Watch the crossfire. <laughs> the heck? Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, we got explosions. Yeah, y'all head up. It's just a mass of dead bodies down here. Oh my gosh. A lot of innocent civilians. This body is absolutely burned to a crisp. Are you okay, guys? Right. We'll continue to move in. Clips empty! Reload! 
Chase them all apart. No, thanks. Gotta reload. You ain't too smart, are you? Still got armed people, so stay diligent. Come all right, let's move in. Got a civilian there. Alright, I'm gonna head down this side of the stairs. Get all the civilians out, that's important. There that must be the bomb. Down here. But go suck a dick. Cover me. You busted. All right, lower levels have been secure. Let's take a look at this bomb. Oh my gosh. They were definitely pointing something serious. So we're going to have to get the bomb defu defusal unit down here. Go ahead and take care of this. Let's just go back up. Um, we're going to send them in once it's absolutely clear. These are very technically skilled people who are trained in defusing bombs. So obviously we don't want to put them at any unnecessary risk by having them shot before they're even able to get to the bomb. We're going to have units stationed down here now that we cleared out a lot of these individuals. I think it was more than 10 to 15 armed, more like 25 to 30 armed. There's just so many dead bodies right here. Look at this. Absolutely crazy. We're going to have to get paramedics down here once we clear it. It's going to be a very, very large cleanup scene. That's going to take a lot of time to work through this. A lot of paperwork. Just, I'm looking at it now and it's it's absolutely ridiculous how many bodies there are. That's going to conclude today's episode. Trying something a little different. I hope you enjoyed it. As always, I love to hear your feedback. I will add this map mod. Or it's uh, actually a map editor mod. I'll add it to the Google document if you're interested in downloading it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next.